All right, welcome back to Star Sector. So I've made some changes to our fleet. I've outfitted the Xenorphica with Autopulse and Disintegrator. Um, two Autopulses is actually, I think, what I would like. Anything, I don't know. Um, it's a weird setup. Got Animatter Blasters, uh, Heavy Blaster, Heavy Machine Gun. I don't know if it's really going to help that much, but it's extra kinetic damage. And I have a cat on my computer. Please don't do that. All right, stay in my lap. Just, no, she wants attention. Um, anyway, uh, I've put the Animatter SRM launcher on the Paragon and uh, Heavy Needlers on the Onslaught with um, re flux resistant conduits. I don't, I don't know. I think this isn't working. I don't know. Uh, I hope the thermal pulses will be enough explosive damage. It's not explosive damage, but you know what I mean. Uh, enough damage. Uh, I just need these to puncture shields, and I think I should be okay. Please don't lick me. Alright, um, cat. Not you, dear viewer. Bringing in the USS Ignoramus. I don't think this ship's gonna help me at all. Uh, but it does have uh, the heavy lasers. Okay. Uh, I've taken off Oh my god, cat, stop it. Um, I've taken off the plasma cannon and put on the tachyon lance and a graviton beam on this ship. Um, do not mess with the microphone. Um, and I've got the Desert Eagle here with its own auto cannons just to get through shields. Uh, let's see. Yeah, basically that's it. I've, and uh, as far as officers, I've reshuffled. I'm going to be controlling my capital ships and. Um, <laughs> <laughs> this cat. Uh, I've put a reckless officer on the layman's liqueur, and we are going to go and see what we can do about that remnant fleet that we found in hyperspace. God damn it. Hello? <sighs> okay. Thankfully, I don't have to edit my video because that was just the waste disposal company telling me they're not picking up our garbage today. Or something. I don't know. Whatever. I already picked up our garbage, so I don't see why it matters to me. Anyway. Um, I was like, Ugh, don't be like some important call I have to take right now. There's the fleet. Go in. All right, the holes are pitted and in some places appear to be subtly warped. Despite the visible damage, sensors detect dormant power sources which start to come online even as your bridge crew finishes an initial tactical assessment. After a moment of surprise, your comms officer speaks. Ma'am, we've got transponder pings. The codes are standard tritachyon, but according to our last registry update, they're over 200 cycles out of date. Continue. Move in to engage. Transfer command. Think to the Paragon. Continue. So I want to put out the Paragon, but then I also want my fast ships to go capture some points for me. Um, let's put out the Eagles. And... Or Eagle and destroyer. Let's see what we can do here. Okay, so this wolf try to capture that. Try to capture that. Um, let's see what we can do. don't like splitting up my fleet, but they are just frigates, and I was reading a guide online about how to deal with remnants, and they were saying that you want to capture um, these tactical points so that you get more deployment points, and so that way you can get your whole fleet out there, because apparently the remnants are not constrained and can just basically deploy everything they have, so even though they have a smaller fleet... Um, even though they have a smaller fleet, they can get more of their junk out there. So we got 18 points now. <sighs> OK. 
Okay. Let's go for the comm relay. Let's see if you can capture that. I feel about this, but try to capture this point. Good. Okay. And you're still over there. You are not going to be able to hold on to that. So don't even try. You are spending a lot of rockets just to kill one little frigate. And it's not working, is it? There's their capital ship. That is very bad. Help here, guys. Come on, get that cruiser. Get that cruiser, damn you. Good. Show me what we can see here. Okay. Okay. Let's bend quickly, please. Bring in anything else? Not really. We got a fulgent. Good. But the wolf has been disabled. Bad. Come on, get him, get him. You're gonna have to hang on to that one, okay? Because I gotta deal with this guy right in front of me here. Got him, okay. Okay, this is a problem. Can we get turned around? We can get him. We need to put our shields up. Good. Why? There we go. Okay. Drovers down. Guys. For 
get that point. I need you killing him. GN, please. Don't get yourself killed. You got him. Good. deal with this thing. Tank this. Cannot tank this. Withdraw. New plan. Destroy what we can. Good. Oh man. Avoid. Do not engage. We cannot we cannot run that ship. But we will try. be the right choice. I think we are dead. Best we can do is buy time for you guys to please kill that. <laughs> Actually, Grab that. Grab that. I am just doing this. <laughs> just fortress shield as long as I can. shield down I don't know that was not what I meant to do I meant to turn my fortress shield off so that I could attack that we are about to overload Okay. Zenorfica. 
It's time. See if you can take that out, please. We've got him surrounded. I'm gonna have to take that avoid order off, I'm afraid. Not enough to deploy anything. What's your combat readiness? Why don't you start to withdraw? What's your combat readiness? You're still good. Love it if you could kill that thing. Kill it. What the hell's going on? Oh my god. Please try to kill this thing. Come on, guys. Prepare for another burst. Okay. Prepare for another burst. Got you, you bastards. Oh my god. Ugh. So that was a one-star fight. <sighs> no. You can stay destroyed. Wow, we lost a lot of crew. Okay. I don't need that drone ship. I don't need my hammerhead back. Oh my god. 
Oh, that was ridiculous. Pick through the wreckage. All that, and all we got was a gamma core. Probably back from our destroyed ship. Are you kidding me? Are you freaking kidding me? That's all we got? Oh my god. Oh no, we did. We got a Gamma Core. After all of that. Yeah, you could say I'm not entirely pleased with this result. That was an incredibly hard fight. Way harder than what the game was telling me it should have been. And we got basically nothing. Quite salty, am I? <sighs> Hell, I'm putting the Xenorphica back into storage. USS Ignoramus, also back into storage. Uh. The lightning, thankfully, we recovered it because I don't want to lose my Animator SRM. It's a good weapon. I mean, I guess we didn't have to take the serial peacemaker with us, but put the Desert Eagle back into storage. Okay. Lehman's liqueur. I'm gonna keep that in my fleet for now. Happy with the Rocky Mountain Oyster. I did refit it a little bit. Okay. I need bombers. I need I need an astral or something, man. Because crikey. I got that was not good. Oh boy. Okay. This'll do for now. I could take another automated ship with me, since I have a core for it. Let's take a look at it real quick. End the episode on a happier note of looking at what this thing can do. Small energy turrets. Medium energy hard point. Hmm. Beam weapons only. Integrated targeting unit. What size cliffs is this ship? Let's say destroyer. Okay. Well. Well, destroyer. I have a heavy blaster. Um, have a couple sabos, have IR pulse lasers, range 500, range 600, uh, here, hmm. <clears throat> Yeah, I guess the Typhoons are not the worst. They're not the best, but... Uh, a couple BDs. 
No, PDs go here. Over here. More IR pulses. And then just tons of vents. Wow, that is nowhere near enough flux ventilation for you. Uh, probably ought to go with that then. Okay. That means, do I need all these sh all these ships? Probably not. I could leave the lightning behind. I think I will. I do not think I need it. Uh, give me that AI core. Let's take that junk and get it sold for once and for all. Okay. Where is it? You've got one, and now you've got one. Okay. Okay. Uh, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Thanks for watching. That was brutal. Brutal and not worth it at all. Oh, man. I'm, I'm not... I'm salty. I'm very salty about this. But we won. That could have gone worse. If I hadn't found out about that tactic against the remnants. Um... So, yeah, I didn't, I actually didn't know that, I'm embarrassed to say, that capturing those command points like that, it explains some mysteries I'd had in my past about, like, where did all my command points come from? Or my deployment points. But, yeah, capturing those points is freaking important. We have one idle officer. Uh, idle officer, you shall pilot something. Actually, I'll fire that idle officer. I don't know who it is. Um... Anyway, as always, thanks for watching. I will see you next time. Until then, bye-bye.